Hello everyone, welcome back. Today we'll be taking a look at the Echo Complete Kit. Um, the Echoes are probably one of the most powerful batteries on the market today. They come in either the 650 batteries or the 1100. Here, as you can see, it's a bit longer. The uh, battery will last longer as well. It's the perfect choice if you need a battery that will last you nearly all day. Uh, okay, let's take a closer look. Yeah. Those are the batteries. The kit comes with the mains charger, USB charger, and the bottle of what's inside. We'll see the cartomizers and mouthpieces. Okay, let's take a closer look at the batteries. The 650 or 1100 both comes as a manual battery which means you have to uh, press the button while smoking to inhale. Um, to charge, simply just connect to the USB charger. This can either be plugged into the PC P, uh, USB port or through the mains adapter. Charging time varies from two to three hours for a full charge. When the light on the USB charger turns from red to green, that's when you know your battery is fully charged. Okay, now let's take a closer look at the cartomizer. The cartomizer is responsible for turning the e-liquid into uh, vapor. Uh, our Echo kits, the cartomizer on the Echo kits already come pre-filled, so you don't need to fill it up yet. Just screw that into the battery, put on the cap the mouthpiece I should say and there you have a fully assembled Echo electronic cigarette. The lifespan of the cartomizers uh, de depends on how much you smoke can last up to about 30 days before you need to replace it. Okay once you stop getting vapor from the cartomizer it's about time to refill it. To refill just um, remove the cartomizer from the battery pop off the mouthpiece and get your bottle e-liquid and point the nozzle onto the side of the cartomizer the inner side never down the middle and while rotating the cartomizer just give it a few squeezes uh, you can see the um, cotton wick inside being filled as it absorbs the liquid when it stops absorbing that's how you know it's filled or when a little bit of liquid goes through the other end that means it's full after that just give it a quick wipe put the mouthpiece back on screw it back on the battery and you're ready to vape once again